Hey guys, um, I'm so sorry I haven't posted a video in a long, long time. Um, I've been extremely busy. I just finished my student teaching. I start um, spring courses tomorrow, and that's really sucks because I'm totally done with school. I just, I, I'm so done with school. Um, also, I am moving, so mid-May, I think. Or we already have the house. We sold, my dad's girlfriend sold her house, and now we have to sell our house, but I don't know when we're moving. I think the move-in date's like mid-May, but then I'm pretty sure I have like midterms. I don't know how it works. Anyways, I also have a wedding to go to, so if I'm moving and I'm leaving the country, I don't know how that's going to work. And I know my dad's going to try to throw out all my um, shoes and purses. He's already tried, and I've caught him. I'm like, why is my purses in the junk pile? What's going on? Yeah, and I just want to say thanks to my grandma for sending me this magazine. I got it. Um, it's not Ray, but I love it still. Um, I love any Japanese magazines, so I'm happy to get that. And um, happy Mother's Day, so okasan, arigato for everything. Yeah, so um, today I'm going to make omoraisu, and it's something that my mom has made for me many times during my childhood. So if you're interested in wanting to learn how to make it, then just continue watching. And also, sorry, my hair is a complete gong show. I need to cut it or something because it's like down to here, and I don't even know how to style it anymore. Like, I need to keep it up for work. Cause oh oh yeah so um the other day I got peanut sauce splashed all over my hand and now I have hives which sucks because this happened last time on my arm and I had it for like a month so if in the video I have hives on my hands yeah that's the reason all right so just continue. So I'm just going to add a little bit of butter and some oil to fry the onions in. And you just want to cook it until it becomes translucent. You don't want to burn it. Now I'm just going to add in the garlic. I'm just going to put in some chicken bouillon powder. And just cook until the chickens cook through. And then I'm going to add some green peas at the end. Right, so the chickens cook through, now I'm just going to add some green peas. And I'm just adding some rice that I cooked um, with chicken stock. And there's some mushrooms and carrots already diced into it. You want to make sure you don't um, overcook it so the rice becomes mushy, just enough to incorporate the ketchup flavor. And that seems like it's good enough.
just gonna add some butter to the pan. And I'm just going to wait till the pan gets a little bit hotter. Alright, so now I'm just going to add the eggs. Bring all the um, cooked parts to the middle and just the runny parts to the, to the edge. All right, let's see if I can do this. Crap. Okay, so I'm not winning points on how beautiful it is, but I think it's pretty why does my omelet look like crap I think it's this Teflon plan it's so scratched up and it sucks I'm kind of disappointed now I feel like I have a lot of rice for just two eggs but whatever I'm gonna add some ketchup to it and then just a garnish. And that's omurais, something that I used to eat when I was little. Obviously this one doesn't look good, but I think it's kind of okay. I think you're supposed to cut into it and it's supposed to like open or something. Maybe I waited too long to cut into it. Oh, come on, fall over. Come on. Okay, whatever. I tried. I think I waited. I was taking pictures and it kind of set, but... There you go, that's the final dish. Okay. And the result? Yeah? What does it taste like? What does it taste like? Because I know it tastes all like awesome. Very awesome. Lovely chicken. Very creamy eggs. Just done right. 10 out of 10. <laughs>